What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth, and steel. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you? But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! <laughs> and so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough. And you, blessing its name like it was one I of I know my duty to them. Tribe. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow.
Oh, that's a lot of berries. You're quite the gatherer, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more, hmm? Well done, that's a good boy. Children, come with me. She's an outcast to be shunned. There. Oh, come on. can get through. This must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. never go in places like this. But I have to find a way out.
There is something up ahead. What's that? A dead person. There's something shiny there. A metal door, closed. Maybe this device I found can help. Get it open. More lights. A shape. It's connected to the door somehow. Changed color.
door changed color too. It didn't. device, like the one I found. You think I want it this way? It's the best I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but... We can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Sure does love his little big man. Lining up the community room. Like 
cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything, anymore. Lining up in the community room. Like cattle in a slaughterhouse, but smiling at each other. Shauna handing out meds like being alive is some kind of pain to be eased. Well, not me. I don't want to go quiet. I don't want to trail off. I want a period at the end of my life sentence, not an ellipsis. Hell, <laughs> an exclamation mark. So if that upsets whoever finds this, too bad. I don't know anyone, anything, anymore. Seriously, 
record our thoughts for posterity. Why did they die here? Great idea, Director. What happened to them? Like, I haven't done enough for posterity already. Like, I wouldn't be here like this if not for posterity. I'm done with posterity. Posterity can go. Machu Picchu. Always wanted to see that. Never did. Why didn't I go with Owen when he asked? Stupid. Should have gone. Well. Come, girl. Take my hand. You don't belong down there. Come! <sighs> Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! <sighs> well, if you're gonna go sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. Thank you. 
mean? Take your bow. Bow? And enough muttering to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now, you're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called South Brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Aloy, come now. Gather the berries. Good. Now eat the berries. Blech. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? Aloy, I'm trying to teach you. Aloy, I'm trying to teach you. This valley is just a part of all mothers' embrace. Embrace. The Nora tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Aloy, a machine's coming. Crouch there. Now stay low. We don't want... No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Oh, another one. Let it pass. The slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. That's the last of them. Let's move on. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead.
Ignore him. But why is he up there? He's smiling at us. Teb! Get back where you belong! Teb! Where are you? Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. And he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. There. See them? These are called striders. Get! Why'd you chase them off? <sighs> to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. Best approach by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with him further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow. Aloy, over here. Aloy, over here. Stop wasting time. There's the herd. All right, it's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. There. Come, girl, it's safe now.
Harvest a kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Good. Now I see you've already gathered stocks of Ridgewood. Use the stocks as arrow shafts and metal shards for our heads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Here. Stay low in the grass and be quiet. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. Strider. One of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter, if she's careless. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? Guess that. The device. It showed me. But that plaything? Stop playing games. Now, take down that strider. Target the eye or the canister. And if it charges, be ready to roll out of the way. Again! You do well today, but you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Aloy, quick!
need to do this slowly and quietly. Can't let them see me. their path. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. Bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips. They are outcasts both. And she is motherless. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. Mother.
Oh, you're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the Matriarchs brought you to me. So the Matriarchs, they know? It's not so simple. But they know! Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The Matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me! It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care! How do I do it? Tell me! The Proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the Proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard, and it will take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Rost? 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 Where is he? Two days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that.
These will keep. He said we'd go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? What's he doing up there? He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Aloy, you're here. Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Descend into the embrace, and hunt until you have gathered the parts for fire arrows. Fire arrows? What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Is something else bothering you? No, I'm fine. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe and I will still be an outcast. To be shunned. Rost, even if the tribe accepts me, I won't- There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. Okay. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace? Oh... Uh, Odd Grotto might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. <sighs> Wouldn't mind, if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> Grotta follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. I'll go gather the parts, but... I'm also going to pay Karst to visit. Aloy, that man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. And I'm glad he does. I want to buy a trip caster and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. All right, see you at the North Gate. Something's really bothering him. If he thinks I'm gonna abandon him, he's wrong.
can't be too prepared. for some fire arrows. I should find a herd. Mother's heart. Two more days, and I'll know what it's like in there. It's so many people crammed into one place. Why is I guess no one ever gets lonely me? in there. Ill-mannered outcast. The outcast's pushing her luck <sighs> these days. speak to those cast out by the matriarchs. I just want to go about my day. <clears throat> Been on duty all day. My feet are growing the roots. Speak to you. Will you not help me? You want to talk to an outcast? I'm desperate for help. Whatever the consequences. What's the problem then? 
Trouble with your leg? Forget about me. It's my daughter, Arana. She's in danger. She went after a scrapper near Mother's Cradle, and I fear for her life. I can't even stand up, let alone go after her. Will you help me find her? You said Arana went to Mother's Cradle? Yes. Southeast of here. I forbid her from going, but ever since her mother died, she's become impossible. Damn it, look at me. A widower, now a cripple. Father that can't find his daughter. Please, help me set things right. Why would your daughter hunt a scrapper on her own? It's my fault. I went after it first, and it tore up my leg. I barely got away, and I left a spear impaled in the machine. That spear was made by Adina, my mate, who died last year. It means everything to Arana. She, she went after the scrapper to get it back. You know the matriarchs might cast you out for speaking to me, don't you? I don't care. I tried looking for her myself, and my leg gave out. Just find her. I'll accept any punishment if it means she's safe. I'll do what I can to help your daughter. Make sure she's all right. I'm begging you. Arana's still in danger. What else do you need? I'll be on my way. Tommy, this is it.
for later. for an old remedy. I'll tuck that away. do nicely.
because I'm shunned doesn't mean I won't pass through. And their attacks drive us from the sacred land. Took on three watchers yesterday. One hit each. Time to see Karst and get a tripcaster. We must follow the rules of the tribe. We are there. This isn't right. An outcast must know her place. It's against the law to speak to outcasts. Oh no, outcasts. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. My guess is he'll be waiting for me. There he is. Looks nervous. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> Is there a reason why you're acting so cranky today? Once you run the proving and get made a brave, you'll deal with traitors in Mother's heart. Maybe I don't like losing customers. Traitors who don't break the law and deal with outcasts, you mean? That's right. Our days of crime will be behind us, so long as you keep quiet. Are you worried I'm going to tell someone that you trade with outcasts? I don't think you're the kind who talks, but you never know. You can stop worrying. The secret's safe with me. Yeah, that's what I figured. But I don't mind hearing it. Why do you take the risk, trading with outcasts? Every time you ask. If a big, meaningful talk is what you're after, move along. It's because you used to be one, isn't it? Yeah. Got caught poking around one of the metal ruins out beyond the Embrace. Matriarch said I was tainted and gave me five years. What did you see in the ruins? Nothing I can make sense of. After my shunning, I tried living back in Mother's heart, but... Everyone I knew had moved on, and there were so many people everywhere I turned. I like it better out here. The only person I've ever told about our trades is Rost. Yeah, well, not like he can turn me in, even if he wanted to. Law and duty sort of a man, that Rost. I don't know how you stand it. 
You really don't know why he was cast out? I've told you no. I don't think anyone knows what he did, but it must have been serious because his term is for life. Last time I visited, you had a trip caster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. I thought you wanted a trip caster. I'm ready to trade when you are. Got yourself a trip caster. Practice how to use it someplace else, all right? My life's exciting enough without a bunch of shock wire booby traps to trip over. Really? Could have fooled me. <laughs> Will you be around later in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. Another day, another trade. I guess that concludes our business. All right. Good luck in the proving. Blessing of all mother and all that. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rost at the North Gate.
They're scanning for me. Must be Arana. Sounds like she's in trouble. Thank you. I thought those watchers were gonna tear me apart. Your father sent me after you. It's time to go home. I figured. But I can't go back until I get my mother's spear from that scrapper! Your father is worried sick about you. He gets worried if I go ten steps to relieve myself in the bushes. He just... He doesn't want to lose you, Alana. I know, but I do wish he wouldn't yell at me so much. How did you wind up in that tree? I tracked the scrapper to Mother's cradle. Caught a glimpse of it too, but then a watcher saw me and called his pack. By oh, Mother, I'm just not a good enough hunter to get that spear back, am I? That spear must mean a lot to you. My mother made it not long before she died. I can't believe my father lost it. He didn't mean to. Scrappers are dangerous. I know. I just can't stand the idea that it might be gone forever. I'll look for your spear. You will? Oh, thank you. Go find your father. His leg gave out while he was searching for you, just south of Mother's heart. Oh, no. Okay, I'll go to him right away. Thanks again.
Who are you calling out for? Do you need help? I have nothing against outcasts. Far from it. But I shouldn't talk to you. I don't want to get in trouble. I don't see anyone else around to help. I guess you're right. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to be callous. My brother was cast out, but his sentence has ended. He, he should have come home, but he didn't. And, and his camp was covered in blood. You, um... You said your brother's camp was soaked with blood? The Braves went looking for him, and, and that's what they found. All I can think about is what might have happened. Is he really dead? Or maybe just wounded? Is he suffering? Does he need help? I can't stand it not knowing. What are you doing out here all alone? Each day I cut a notch on the wall so I knew Brahm's sentence was over. Then I cut three more. But he still hadn't come back. I begged the matriarchs to send braves to find him and all they found was a blood-soaked camp. The braves said he must be dead. But I have to know the truth. So I came out looking for him. Why was your brother cast out? Rom was always a little different. A little touched. One of the hunters had a cruel heart and never let him alone. I was gone but an hour, and the hunter said after him like always, but this time, Brahm struck back with a rock and split the man's skull. Spirits made him do it, he said. Whispers of the forgotten. It cost him ten years. I never should have left him alone. <laughs> what do you mean, forgotten? All mother curses blasphemers who won't repent, banishing them from her eternal memory. Those lost spirits are the forgotten. Brahm used to say they spoke to him, told him to do things. It was such a burden for him, and, and there was nothing I could do to help. I'll do what I can to find your brother. You will? Then let me come with you. I won't be a bother. I know how to stay out of sight. I'm faster on my own. If that is how it must be, just find him then. Please.
Let's do this. Kept it close to your heart. Hello, Grotta. Oh, mother. Since I was cast out, have I not been constant as the river flows? Have I not kept the vows as the stones do? Show me your grace, all mother, and provide for me once more. Don't worry, Grotta. I'll hunt your rabbits. Oh, mother. I hear your voice on the wind. 
I would count your blessings on my prayer beads, but I lost them atop the Eastern Overlook. My old bones are too worn to return. So it's rabbits and your trinket you need this time. Okay, I'll find you at your camp. Easy, easy. And one of these. Rada said her prayer beads were at the Eastern Overlook. It's not far from here. Giving me that. 
trail up the rocks is close by. Gotta may be devout, but it takes strong arms to reach the overlook the fast way. This looks promising. Aha! Grata's prayer beads. I see why she comes up here to pray. It looks out to Mother's Gate. You know, I wonder what bothers me more. That she ignores me, or that with all her talking to all mothers, she's never lonely. Save these for the trail. Never know when I might need these. There's Grata, all alone with Allmother. 
field. Good news, Grata. Once again, All Mother has brought you rabbits. I found your prayer beads, too. Just try not to lose them again. All Mother. Each morning I find your tears of joy speckling the leaves. Joy at the beauty of all you have made. See how I cry now with you in gratitude. So you'll cry for her, but you won't speak to me. Fine. Guess that makes you the better outcast. Grata, I may not be around much for a while. I'm gonna run in the proving, and... I'm not sure what's gonna happen after that. Oh, Mother. I thank you for the kindnesses you share. When the proving comes, in your great wisdom, may you give favor to a brave of generous heart. I... think I get what you're saying. Goodbye, Grata. For now. Oh, Mother. Hear me as I count off my years of devotion from these beads. Let me whisper to you as your soothing whisper comes in the hushing of the grass. Oh, Mother, see how the beads have been warm. Party little plant. You'll help. Here, must be where she saw the scrap. If I follow its tracks, I should be able to find that spear. Goddess, forgive me, but it is forbidden to talk to our friends. The trail ends here. I'll bet it crossed the river. Better check the other side.
room's been in the air for a while. There. Time to get that spear. Well-made weapon. Arana will be happy to have it back. Good. I can use this. Stocking up. Mother be praised. Aloy's back with the spit. First you send Arana back to me, and now you've got the spear. When I first called out to you for help, I didn't even know if you'd speak to me. I'm glad you did. <laughs> me too. I can't believe you got the spear back. Your mother knew how to craft them. It's of exceptional make. I'll never be the crafter she was, but she did pass along a few tricks. I'd be happy to take a look at your spear. Thank you. It sounds like 
She was special. I'm sorry for your loss. Well, because of you, I still have the spear to remember her by. You didn't have to help us, but you did. She would have admired that. Thank you, Aloy, for everything. When I think what it would have been like if I had lost Arana, I... Well, thank you, Halo. but no body. There's gotta be more to this. Looks like a few drops of blood lead away from the camp.
Whose knife is this? Did someone attack Brom with it? Looks like more blood leading away from here. Did someone bring the blood to the camp? The trail of blood ends here. But whoever left it must have also left tracks. Bring that up later. That's twisted. I wonder if the blood from the camp came from this war. If Brom did this, why does he want people to think he's dead? And why desecrate the shrine? Oh, what are those scrappers picking at?
looks like it was a watcher. If it's Brom, he definitely knows how to handle a spear. supplies. Brom was an outcast for a long time. Why take food and gear now? <sighs> the supplies from the cache. Why would they take them and just throw them away? <laughs> if you don't promise, I'll jump! <laughs> I will! I'll, I'll kill myself! I'll kill myself before I hurt her! I will. I'll, I'll kill myself. I'll kill myself before I hurt her. You, you're not a spirit. What do you want? I want you to step away from the edge, Brom. No. Leave me alone. Can't you see I need time to think? I, how, how, how am I supposed to think when everybody is shouting at me? So many voices to listen to. It must make your head hurt. I promise my voice will be soft and soothing. A soft voice, like Alara's. It's been so long. Years. Yes. Yes, I... I will listen. That's better. Now tell me, what's troubling you? The spirits of the Forgotten. Souls cursed by the All-Mother. Their voices never let me be. They want me to do things, hurt people. If I go back to the Nora, they might make me hurt Alara. And I, I'll kill myself before I let that happen. Do you have to listen to the spirits, Brom? They're speaking to me right now. Always with me. They take care of me, keep me company, help me. Except when they scream. Like when that hunter knocked me down? Crush your skull with the rock, they said. And I did. Brom. You're alive. Oh, mother be praised. I'm sorry I followed you, but I had to make sure he was all right. No, 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 no. Please, sister, I, I, I can't protect you. I need no protection from you, Brom. He fears these spirits that he hears will turn him against you. Unless your voice can quiet them? Yes. Just as it was before. He only ever hurt someone once, and it was provoked. I... 
I don't want to hurt you. But the Forgotten, they're, they're whispers. They, they fill my head with screams. Brahm isn't ready to return to the Nora. But I don't think he'll hurt you, Alara. There's a place where I can stay. A cave on All Mother Mountain. I suppose you could visit me there, so long as I'm strong. You will be, Brom. I'll help you. Thank you, Aloy. I'll take care of him now. May you walk in All Mother's eternal memory. And may the Forgotten leave you be. I'll find a use for you. You have the fire arrows? I do. Those explosions and shouts beyond the embrace. Is that the trouble you were talking about? You will know soon enough. Until then, we wait for dark. Wait for dark? I got Odd Grata her rabbits, for which she thanked All Mother, of course. It was All Mother working through you to bring her the rabbits. You always say that, but I was there and I hunted alone. And you always say that, and so make yourself alone. I saw Karst and got that tripcaster I was talking about. I hate to think what that outlaw trader charged for a weapon of that make. It wasn't cheap, but the caster is worth it. Perhaps. You'll know it's worth soon enough. I don't understand. Those explosions are outside the embrace. What can we do from in here? The lesson will be taught in due time, Aloy. Till then, we wait. Look, Rost. I thought it through. And I'm not going to shun you after the proving, okay? I'm just... I won't do it. I'm not about to pretend that you never raised me. Aloy, the law forbids all contact. It does, and I don't care. I know what duty means for you, Rost, but all tribal law has ever done for me is take things away. And that's not gonna happen again. Aloy, I must obey the law. And so you will. I knew you'd say that, so this is what we'll do. I'll come to you in secret. No one will see me, so I won't get in trouble. A and I know you won't talk to me because it's against the law, but I'll talk to you. It'll be my crime, not yours. You'll just listen. And that's how we'll handle this. You've put a lot of thought into this. I know. So you can stop worrying. It's handled. Yes. So it is. Still a while to go before dark. I guess I'll get some rest. Good idea. There'll be no time for sleep tonight.
Opening a gate for an outcast? Some who are shunned reaped honor before disgrace. <sighs> so much for tribal law. I spoke to no one, and now we must both keep silent, for we are outside of the embrace. These are the true wilds, Aloy, with threats unlike any you have ever faced. That carcass? What sort of beast was that? The tribe calls it a sawtooth, and it's something new. Something angry. Since they first started appearing to...